welcome to Mirror and Thread. I'm Jess, and full disclosure, I'm going to be wearing these blue light glasses all day, even though I know that there's probably a glare because I have a little problem with my corneas and it's bothering me today. So anyway, we're gonna hop right into it. I have a big Abercrombie and Fitch haul for you, and alternative names for this could have been outerwear haul because they are one of my favorite go-to places for outerwear. They just have really good quality jackets and coats and their prices are super reasonable for the quality so let's jump in all right so this is like a wool they call it a dad coat on their site but it's basically just a long wool dress coat super good quality it's very very thick very warm and i love the length of this i think this is so chic and this is going to be a perfect layering piece for fall and winter. I personally love this camel color. It's one of my favorite colors, especially this time of year, but it does come in a couple other colors. It comes in a black and it comes in a plaid as well. For whatever reason, I find the outerwear on me pretty much across the board, I size down to an extra small. I think it's because my shoulders are a little bit more narrow. So I would say true to size, whatever you normally get in jackets and coats, you should be good to get in the outerwear from Abercrombie, but just an FYI for sizing purposes, I do have extra smalls on all of these. So I love this one. I think it's so, so good, especially for the price, and they run good sales on these things typically too. So they're actually 25% off right now, whoops. And then this little number kind of surprised me in a good way. So you know how I feel about, if you've been here a while, about bodycon dresses or um, sweater dresses, I'm typically not a big fan, especially when they are this kind of knit fabric that's a little bit tighter. But this one is very slimming with the way that the fit is. So it's got this slit down the leg that's really slimming and the material is very thick. So you're not gonna have to worry about it being thin and being see-through or anything like that. Full disclosure, I do wear a pair of Spanx when I wear something like this. It just makes me feel more all pulled in in the right places. So I'll go ahead and link the Spanx that I wear too. But I do feel like this one is, as far as like tighter sweater dresses go, this is one of my favorite ones I've ever put on. So I have on this small in this one and um, I was just really pleased with this. So it's more of a knit sweater material and not like a um, soft like cashmere kind of feeling sweater material, if that makes sense. And then this was another favorite piece of mine. So this is just a basic blanket scarf, but I love the neutral colors in this. I think this is a great one if you have family photos coming up and you want just a little bit of a pattern, but not something that's super loud. I think this is a great option for that. It's very, very thick, very warm. So this one, you're actually going to get some warmth from your scarf, which is the whole goal anyways. And um, these make really good gifts too, because they're one size, you don't have to worry about sizing, and who doesn't love a good, chunky, warm scarf? All right, I need to refrain from saying favorite because I really like all of these things and I keep wanting to say that on every one of them. But this one is so, so good. I got so many compliments on this when I wore it out. So this is a plaid blazer coat. So it fits kind of like a blazer, but it is as warm as a wool coat. So this is the perfect workwear option. If you need an option that you wanna be able to walk straight into a business meeting with, this is perfect for that because it's warm enough to wear outside, but you can also still wear it with your business workwear and it's totally work appropriate. So I love the length on this. It's a little bit of a longer blazer coat, but it's not as long as like this dad coat. So I think this is just pure perfection. And I have the extra small in this one too, and it fit perfectly. And I believe this one does come in a plain color if you don't like the plaid, but this is a very nice looking subtle plaid <laughs> to me. So I was all about that. And then this little cami I've actually had for a couple of years, but they keep coming back with this every year from Abercrombie. And I think this is a great piece just to have in your closet as a layering piece. Um, even for workwear, you could easily throw this, you know, under a blazer or something and not be super hot once you get inside. So I have the small and the cami. And then you know how I feel about Abercrombie's jeans. I just love them. They are some of my favorite places, my favorite place to get jeans because I think the quality is really, really good and they always, they're always pretty much under $100 anyways. 
and then they run sales on them a lot for 40 or 50 percent off so you can get these for like 44 dollars which is incredible for what they are so this is the mom jean fit so it is a very high rise which i prefer they have the buttons down the front and this is more of a structured jean so it's not going to be super stretchy but I think these look so flattering on and they have the holes in exactly the right place. And these are an ankle length, which if you remember from my fashion hacks video is perfect if you wanna wear with booties. So I'm really, really excited about these. I have my normal size 27 or four and I get the short length and I'm about 5'3 for reference. Quick side note, these are not from Abercrombie, but I found the number one workwear shoe that I've ever had these are absolute perfection they are from soul society which you've probably heard me talk about before i love them for the quality of their items but these are so comfortable i wore these all around dallas when we were poking around out there <laughs> poking around it's like my grandma but anyways i wore these all around and they were totally comfortable i didn't have any problems with them and they're just super sleek and chic. I love the block heel, it just looks a little bit more modern. And then this kind of comes down a little bit different on the foot too. So it's just, they just are so flattering and they're so great. These are size six and a half, which is my normal size, so true to size in these. Okay, this is the warmest outerwear option that I got and also one of the most affordable out of the entire thing. So I believe that this is, let me double check that I'm not saying. Yeah, this is $140. I mean, that seems like a really good price for a big Sherpa coat that is as thick and as warm as this one. So like I said, they do run pretty good sales on these too, typically. Right now they're 25% off if you're watching this recently, but de definitely check out the links because I know that they run good sales on all of their things pretty regularly. But this is a similar fit to the first dad coat that I was sharing, and actually I think this one's on as Sherpa dad coat too, but it's got pockets on both sides. I love the length because you're not gonna have to worry about it being too short and your backside being cold, which I hate in the winter when you've been down or something. And this one does come in other colors too. This is the rust color, and it's almost got kind of like a mix between an orange and a pink kind of to me. So it looked like it was going to be a little bit darker of a brownie rust color online than in person. So you might just be aware of that, but it also comes in, I believe a tan and a black. And then this is not from Abercrombie, but I've had this little leopard sweater from H&M since last year. So I wanted to throw this in and just talk about it for a second. It's only $35 and um, it's really soft and cozy. So if you need just a good basic leopard sweater, I think this is a good one to have on hand. Also, the jeans that I was wearing with that outfit, I don't have them up here right now, but those are from Abercrombie too, and they are on sale, I believe, right now as well. Alrighty, this is the only outfit that didn't include an outerwear piece, but it does include this super wonderful, chunky cardigan, which I love cardigans like this, especially when it starts getting cooler because there's nothing worse than a layering piece that actually doesn't provide any warmth in the winter. So I love this one. This is the mustard yellow color, which I am such a fan of. And I consider this to be almost a neutral in my wardrobe. If you don't wear as much mustard yellow or this kind of color palette, they do have it in more neutral colors too, like a gray and a black. And I have a small in this one. It's just very warm, super soft. And then I was really impressed with this little dress. So I need to, I had it all tied up earlier when I was filming for it, but this is just a basic shirt dress, but the material on this is better than most flannels that I've touched. So it's a very, very soft flannel material. It's not stiff in the slightest. So I thought this was a really good option. It does have pockets on both sides too. And this would be great for if you have business casual workwear. I think this is totally appropriate for that. And I have the small in this one. I would say it probably runs on the smaller side. I was okay in the small, but if you're between sizes, I would probably size up one. Another note on some shoes, because I just got these booties in from Soul Society too, and same with the heels. 
these are probably the most comfortable tall boots that I've ever put on. So they are a wedge heel, which means you're, the bottom of your heel is not going to hurt no matter how long you wear these. So they're really nice, like suede feeling material. Very much worth the investment to me if I can wear these and my feet not hurt because that is such a big deal to me. And even for workwear, I think these look appropriate with, like if you have more casual workwear, you can wear like a shirt dress with it. But even if you do them with a pencil skirt or something, I feel like this is still appropriate. And they hit me right underneath the knee, which is just perfect for where I want them to hit. And they come in brown and black too. All right, last little piece. So, just did something crazy to my hair. Another plaid jacket. Could you see what I was really into? when I was on the site making this order. It was definitely neutral plaid. But this one's a collarless coat, so it's kind of different. But I like this because this allows you to wear like a big scarf over it and it doesn't feel as bulky around the neck. So that's kind of just a fun option. For whatever reason, this one ran a little bit more small to me than the other one, so I had the extra small and it was okay. But if I really would have wanted to button it up, I probably should have gotten the small in this one. So. You might just kind of be aware of that when you're ordering, but this comes in some other non-plaid colors, but I just love these neutrals, and I love the idea of winter whites and tans, so that's kind of how I styled this with some white jeans. It just kind of, I don't know, debunks the whole no white after Labor Day myth that doesn't really apply anymore, so I was really pleased with this one. And then this little top is new from Abercrombie too, and it is insanely soft. I think they call it, yeah, they call this soft A&F cozy. <laughs> so they have like an entire line of this material that's almost like a fleece slash micro suede slash, I don't even know, but it's really soft and comfy. This one's a nice wrap top and it is a true wrap. So it goes all the way down and then you can tie this up tighter or looser as you see fit, but this comes in a few other colors too, and I think this is a nice layering piece or even a workwear piece. All right, that's a wrap on the Abercrombie haul. As usual, everything I talked about is linked in the video description box, so you can find photos and sizing info for everything there, and if you follow me in the Like to Know It app, you can find even more daily outfit notifications and sale notifications. Thanks so much for watching.